Hello and welcome to Dia's Fun Play. In today's video, let's see what is sand mining and the harmful effects of sand mining on our environment. Sand mining is a process of removing sand from its natural environment. This sand is mainly used for construction works, glass making and many other domestic and industrial uses. Sand is removed from its natural sources like ocean beds, river beds, beaches, inland dunes and various sand pits and land masses. Did you know that sand is the second largest exploited natural resource in the world after water? Sand is formed when rocks break down through natural weathering process and erosion over millions of years. Rock starts traveling through rivers and streams thousands of miles away from the ocean. As these rocks travel along the way, they constantly break down into small particles called sand. Once these sand particles make it to the ocean, they further erode and gets fine and polished from the constant action of waves and tides. This is why the sand found in the beaches and rivers looks white and shiny. The sand that we see in beaches and river beds today are the result of natural weathering and erosion of rocks for thousands of years. Despite the Supreme Court order that prohibits illegal sand mining, thousands of tons of sand are being illegally mined every day to meet the rising demand in the construction industry and for mineral extraction. Sand mining has a number of harmful effects on our environment. Sand mining can completely destroy the natural habitat in mined areas. Excessive sand mining may alter the riverbed and force the river to change its course. This leads to riverbank erosion and causes floods. Erosion due to sand mining has an impact on the local wildlife too. Every year, many hectares of fertile lands are lost across the river shores. Forests, wildlife habitats and biodiversity along the river shores are in great danger due to sand mining. Sand serves as an aquifer as well as a natural protective layer on the bottom of the river. The removal of this layer of sand causes downstream erosion resulting in deepening of rivers and enlargement of river mouths. As the river system deepens, local groundwater table is also deepened resulting in water scarcity which affects agriculture and local livelihoods. As illegal sand mining continues unchecked, it is high time to act and regulate sand mining now. People have to be educated to use alternative material for sand. Some of the substitutes for sand are M sand, quarry dust, construction and demolition waste, recycled and crushed glass, copper slag, etc. With strong enforcement laws and increased local participation, illegal sand mining can be controlled effectively. And finally, do not forget to spread the word to your friends and families on the effects of illegal sand mining. Thanks for watching the F1 Play. See you in the next video. Subscribe for more videos. Light up subscribe right here, right now. Don't forget, press the bell icon. The choice is yours. The F1 Play.